we often posit that if you asked 100 people in Times Square, are you interested in clean energy and sustainability, that the vast majority of them would say yes. However, when you say, great, what are you going to do about it? They shrug and say, I have no idea. Modern consumers are demanding clean and renewable resources of energy like solar and wind. And ultimately, our role is to be a conduit to connect consumers and their intent with products and services that reflect their beliefs. Traditionally, most people just get their energy from their local utility. And most often that energy is coming from predominantly non-renewable resources. The reality is the utilities industry is actually the number one source of pollution at the industrial level. And so just by making a simple decision to choose renewables over non-renewables, you're able to vote for a cleaner energy future and ultimately have a huge impact on climate change. Our products and services offer consumers the option to buy 100% clean energy. So the way that the clean energy component works is a wind or solar facility generates one unit of electricity. They're able to sell that unit of electricity into the market and also sell an additional product called a renewable energy certificate. And so we ensure that for every unit of energy consumed by an Inspire member, we are purchasing renewable energy certificates. Our business model looks much more like a Netflix or one of these other subscription-based services. And so what that really means is it's a fundamental shift in the payment mechanism of energy. Your energy bill is the same flat fee every month. Our inaugural product is a clean energy subscription that comes along with a kind of data and analytics capability to help make highly contextualized recommendations and improvements in the way that you consume energy and ultimately make you more efficient. People aren't necessarily all environmentalists, but what we do believe is people really care about making really good social and ethical decisions and having a service that delivers a ton of value for them. And that's why we've completely reshaped the experience of how we actually provide that service by providing it in a simple, easy to understand subscription model. So we're able to set subscription pricing based on the home that a consumer lives in, weather patterns in an area, number of people in the home, age of the home, square footage of the home. Ultimately, the way people consume energy is very much a signature of their lifestyle. We're trying to use data to really empower consumers to make smarter and more informed decisions about the way that they use energy. For over 100 years, the energy industry has been an old government-sanctioned monopoly. What we generally have is utility executives and regulators that are making investment decisions on behalf of consumers and that have a very limited incentive for true innovation. Traditionally, what a utility will do is they will say, hey, we need to go build this huge generation plant, and this plant may be $8 billion in total cost. They're not asking that consumer, would you like it to actually come from renewables, or would you like it to be powered by new distributed energy technologies that will actually power a cleaner, smarter, more intelligent world? What our products do is actually put the power in the hands of the consumer to make decisions that reflect uh, the way they see the world and the future that they want for themselves. By exercising the choice to power their homes with renewables, they're actually having a direct impact on shifting investment dollars and creating future investment in new and more renewable energy technologies. Our current membership has already had the equivalent of putting over 85 wind turbines into the grid. And we have the potential to reach over 100 million people with our clean energy subscription. It'd be the same thing as putting over 177,000 new wind turbines into the grid, empowering almost this entire country with clean energy. And so that's why we as Inspire are able to come in and ultimately say, in our world, the consumer is king. We think only about how we can develop technologies that are ultimately going to reshape their experience and give them a new world. And that world for us is 100% powered by clean energy.